In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. peace be with you. And with your spirit. My brothers and sisters, to prepare ourselves to celebrate this Holy Eucharist on the feast day of St. Francis de Sales, the Bishop of Geneva, let us call to mind our sinfulness and ask for the Lord's pardon and strength. I confess to Almighty God and, and to you, my brothers, brothers and sisters, that I have greatly sinned in my thoughts and in my words, in what I have done, in what I have failed to do, through my fault, through my fault, through my most grievous fault. Therefore, I ask Blessed Mary, ever Virgin, all the angels and saints, and you, my brothers and sisters, to pray for me to the Lord our God. May Almighty God have mercy on us, forgive us our sins, and bring us to everlasting life. Amen. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Christ, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Lord, have mercy. Let us pray. O God, who for the salvation of souls will that the Bishop St. Francis de Sales become all things to all, graciously grant that following his example, may we always display the gentleness of your charity in the service of our neighbor, through our Lord Jesus Christ, your Son, who lives and reigns with you in the unity of the Holy Spirit, one God, forever and ever. Amen. A reading from the letter to the Hebrews. Since the law has no more than a reflection of these realities and no finished picture of them, it is quite incapable of bringing the worshipers to perfection with the same sacrifices repeatedly offered year after year. Otherwise, the offering of them would have stopped because the worshipers, when they had been purified once, would have no awareness of sins. Instead of that, the sins are recalled year after year in the sacrifices. Bulls' blood and goats' blood are useless for taking away sins. And this is what he said on coming into the world. You wanted no sacrifice or oblation? Prepare the body for me. You took no pleasure in holocaust or sacrifices for sin. Then I said, just as I was commanded in the scroll of the book, God, here I am. I am coming to obey your will. Notice that he says first, you did not want what the law lays down as the things to be offered. That is, the sacrifices, the oblations, the holocausts, and the sacrifices for sin, and you took no pleasure in them. And then he says, Here I am. I am coming to obey your will. He is abolishing the first sort to replace it with the second. And this will was for us to be made holy by the offering of his body, made once and for all by Jesus Christ. The word of the Lord. Responsorial Psalm, here I am, Lord, I come to do your will. Here I am, Lord, I come to do your will. I waited, I waited for the Lord, and he stooped down to me. He heard my cry. He put a new song into my mouth, praise of our God. Here I am, Lord, I come to do your will. 
You do not ask for a sacrifice and offerings, but an open ear. You do not ask for holocaust and victim. Instead, here I am. Here I am, Lord, I come to do your will. Your justice I have proclaimed in the great assembly. My lips I have not sealed. You know it, O Lord. Here I am, Lord, I come to do your will. I have not hidden your injustice in my heart, but declare your faithful help. I have not hidden your love and your truth from the great assembly. Here I am, Lord, I come to do your will. Please all stand as we honor the Holy Gospel. Alleluia, alleluia. Let your face shine on your servant and teach me your decrees. Alleluia, alleluia. The Lord be with you. A reading from the Holy Gospel according to St. Mark. Glory to you, O Lord. The mother and brothers of Jesus arrived and standing outside, sent in a message asking for him. A crowd was sitting around him at the time the message was passed to him. Your mother and brothers and sisters are outside asking for you. He replied, Who are my brother? And who are, who is my mother? And looking around at those sitting in a circle about him, he said, Here are my mother and my brothers. Anyone who does the will of God, that person is my brother and sister and mother. The Gospel of the Lord. Jesus brings a message that can unite every nation and every culture. We pray to hear it aright. For every petition, the Lord is my light and my help, whom shall I fear? The Lord is my light and my help, whom shall I fear? God of love, give us hope. May we keep on trying to achieve unity among Christians since we all have the same Lord and Savior who leads us out of darkness. The Lord is my light and my help. Whom shall I fear? We have the good news of God's love and unending forgiveness. 
may we learn to concentrate on what unites us and to respect the honest thoughts of others since we are all sisters and brothers in Christ. For this we pray, the Lord is my light and my help, whom shall I fear? Jesus chose Peter and Andrew and James and John, sons of Zebedee, to go fishing for disciples instead of for fish. May we in our time find young people willing to spend their lives in the service of Jesus. For this we pray. The Lord is my light and my help. We believe we have a great light in the good news of Jesus that needs to be shared with people of other religions. May God bless those who form links with other faiths to share our treasures with them. For this we pray. The Lord is my light and my help. Whom shall I fear? All down the centuries, people have turned to violence to make others share their beliefs, a process which is self-defeating. May we walk and talk in the way of peace with one another. For this we pray. The Lord is my light and my help. Whom shall I fear? And in the silence of our hearts, we now pray for our special intentions. For the special intention of the Munting Tahanan staff and children, for the Bahay Pagibig staff and children, Choi and Yan Hizon, Taro and Dek Hizon, Rifi and Terra Hizon, Paolo and Tuesday Hizon, Rodel Sermonia, Erwin Ode Marzan, Jose Flores, and for the souls of Luis and Remedios Panlilio, Remedios and Mayron and Franco Papa, Ace and Jackie Fernandez, Jesus and Celia Lasatin, Du Canlas, Virilio and Payapa Ligon, Mito Blanco, Rosette Hizon, Mirnawana Hizon, R.V. Hizon, Flor de Luna, Pedro, and Noah. For this we pray. The Lord is my light and my help. Whom shall I fear? God our Father, your son Jesus told Mary of Bethany that only one thing is necessary. We hope and trust in him who lives and reigns with you forever and ever. Amen. Blessed are you, Lord God, of all creation, through goodness which you bread to offer, which earth has given in human hands and made, it will become for us our bread of life. Blessed, Blessed be, be God, God forever. forever. By the mystery of this water and wine, may we come to share in the divinity of Christ, which share with us humanity. Blessed are you, Lord God, God of all creation, to goodness of this wine to offer, fruit of the vine and work of human hands, it will become for us our spiritual dream. Blessed be God forever. Oh. 
כמו שהאמי נקלטי, הם כלם שמי פה מאישים. Pray, brethren, that my sacrifice in yours may be acceptable to God, the Almighty Father. May the Lord accept the sacrifice at your hands for the praise and glory of his name, for our good and the good of all his holy church. Through this saving sacrifice, which we offer you, O Lord, Kindle in our hearts that divine fire of the Holy Spirit with which you wonderfully inflamed the most gentle soul of St. Francis de Sales through Christ our Lord. Amen. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. Lift up your hearts. <clears throat> Let us give thanks to the Lord our God. It is right and just. It is three right and just our duty and our salvation. Lord, Holy Father, Almighty and Eternal God, through Christ our Lord. For us on the festival of St. Francis de Sales, you bid your church rejoice. So too, you strengthened her by the example of his holy life. Teach her by his words of preaching and keep her safe in answer to his prayers. And so with a company of angels and saints, we sing the hymn of your praise, as without end we acclaim, holy, 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 holy Lord, Lord God of hosts, heaven and earth are full of your glory, Hosanna in the highest. Blessed is he who comes in the name of the Lord, Hosanna in the highest. <clears throat> Lord, you are indeed holy, the fount of all holiness. Make holy, therefore, these gifts, we pray, by sending down your Spirit upon them like the dewfall, so that they may become for us the body and blood of our Lord Jesus Christ. At the time we was betrayed and entered willingly into his passion, He took bread and giving thanks, broke it and gave it to his disciples saying, take this all of you and eat of it for this is my body which will be given up for you. In a similar way, when supper was ended, he took the chalice, and once more, giving thanks, he gave it to his disciples, saying, Take this, all of you, and drink from it, for this is the chalice of my blood, the blood of the new and eternal covenant, which will be poured out for you and for many for the forgiveness of sins. Do this in memory of me. The mystery of faith. We proclaim your death, O Lord, and we profess your resurrection until you come again. <clears throat> Therefore, as we celebrate the memorial of the death and resurrection, we offer you, Lord, the bread of life and the chalice of salvation, giving thanks that you have held us worthy 
to be in your presence and minister to you. Humbly we pray that partaking of the body and blood of Christ may be gathered into one by the Holy Spirit. Joseph. Remember, Lord, your church spread throughout the world and bring her to the fullness of charity. Together with Francis, our Pope, Jose, our Bishop, and all the clergy. Remember also our brothers and sisters who have fallen asleep in the hope of the resurrection and all who have died in your mercy. Welcome them into the light of your face. Have mercy on us all, we pray, that with the Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God, Our Lady of Fatima, with Saint Joseph, her spouse, with the Blessed Apostles, and all the saints who have pleased you throughout the ages, we may merit to be co-heirs to eternal life, and may praise and glorify you through your Son, Jesus Christ. Through him, and with him, and in him, O God, Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours forever and ever. Amen. At the Savior's command, and formed by divine teaching, we dare to say, Our Father, who art in heaven, heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Deliver us, Lord, we pray, from every evil. Graciously grant peace in our days, that by the help of your mercy may be always free from sin and safe from all distress as we await the blessed hope and the coming of our Savior, Jesus Christ. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Lord Jesus Christ, who said to your apostles, Peace I leave you, my peace I give you. Look not on our sins, but on the faith of your church, and graciously grant her peace and unity in accordance with your will, who live and reign forever and ever. Amen. The peace of the Lord be with you always. And with your spirit. Let us now offer each other the sign of peace. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, have mercy on us. Lamb of God, you take away the sins of the world, grant us peace. Behold the Lamb of God. Behold him who takes away the sins of the world. Blessed are those called to the supper of the Lamb. 
Lord, I'm not worthy that you enter under my roof, but only say the word, and my soul shall be healed.
Let us pray. Grant, we pray, Almighty God, that through the sacrament we have received, we may imitate on earth that charity and meekness of St. Francis de Sales, and so they like him the glory of heaven through Christ our Lord. Amen. Before we give the pain the blessing, I'd like to thank all of you for uh, praying with us uh, at the uh, chapel of the operation. Let us continue praying for peace, justice, and love. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. And may the blessings of Almighty God always abide in you, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Eucharist has been uh, offered. Let's continue responding to the message of Our Lady of Fatima, the Mother of Jesus. Thanks be to God.